So you've got a big test, it's scary, your employer may have paid for it, you don't want to look a fool in front of the people you work with, but you know you can do it, right? You know you can do this. So let's do some tapping, let go of those emotions, let go of those concerns, let go of those fears, and let's focus on passing that test. You with me? Even though I've got this big test coming up and I'm really scared, I know I'm gonna be okay. Even though I've got this test and it's really hard, I know I'm gonna be okay. Even though I've got this test and it's a really tough one and I don't wanna make a fool of myself and fail, I know I'm gonna be okay. So that's your reminder statement. You can switch it around to make it very specific to whatever test it is for you. Just make sure the first part is the concern, even though I have this problem, and the second part is I'm gonna be okay, or I know I'm gonna pass, or I deeply and completely love and accept myself. As I always say, whatever works best for you and makes sense to you. So now let's do the reminder statement. The reminder statement might be something as simply as this test or this exam. You may want to actually use the name of it, but I'm gonna do a little mind read with you and just you tap along and change it up to whatever makes sense for you. This test, eyebrow. This test, side of the eye. This test, under the eye. This test, under the nose. This test, chin. This test, collarbone. This test, underarm. This test, top of the head. Okay, now you know the points. Let's tap a little more specifically on the problem. This test, it's so scary. It's so hard. There's so many questions. So many ways I could get it wrong. What if I fail? What will my employer say? It's so expensive. And they're paying for it. And some people have failed. I really don't look foolish. I need to pass it to get my promotion. I really need to pass this test. There's hundreds of questions. It takes a long time. I've been studying for months. This test, I can't afford to fail it. I can't afford to pay again if I fail it. Never mind how stupid I'm gonna feel. Oh, what if I fail it? I'm filled with anxiety about this test. This test. This test is driving me crazy. I'm thinking about it all the time. And the more I think about it, the worse it gets. Because I've got to pass this test. I've got to pass this test. I need to pass this test. Oh, this test. Oh, it's so stressful. This test. Okay, by now, the emotions maybe starting to fade. So let's switch it up and make it a little more positive. This test. I've done lots of work. I've done a ton of prep. And I know, I know the answers. Yes, yeah, some of them might catch me out. But I'm just as smart as everybody else. If I could just relax then I probably could pass. Because I am smart. They wouldn't have put me in for it if I wasn't smart enough, if I wasn't capable. Look at all the other tests I've passed. I can do this. I can do this test. I'm gonna pass this test. I'm going to pass this test. Oh, I'm feeling better. It's gonna be okay. I've got everything I need to achieve it. 
I'm doing the work. I've done the work. I'm going to pass this test. I'm going to pass this test. Hopefully you're feeling better now. Now, if you watch this and get to this point and think I don't have time to do all that, let me do a really quick one, the positive one, the one that we call the PR triangle, which is a little bit different to EFT. So this is the one where we tap on the side of the hand, under the nose and switch. So I'm just gonna do it with you real quick. You can learn this one, maybe write it down. And then if you're ever out anywhere, just, just do it really quickly. I find this really useful when I'm feeling nervous, when I've got to prepare for something or present something. So think about the test and think about specifically the name of it because the more specific you get the better. I want to pass this test, I can pass this test, I will pass this test, I am passing this test, I'm okay. Under the nose, 20 times, thinking about the test. I've lost count but it doesn't matter. Other hand, making it even bigger. I want to totally pass this test. I can totally and easily pass this test. I will totally and easily pass this test. I am easily, totally passing this test. I'm okay. I'm even more than okay. So, you got this. Best wishes. Let me know how you do questions in the comments if there's anything specific if it's a specific oh i can't speak a specific test that you're working on that you'd like me to focus on you'd have to tell me a few details but comments thank you